Years ago, when I was stationed in the United States under cover of a Moscow radio correspondent, uh, the headquarters of the KGB sent a message suggesting that uh, we travel to uh, Florida and try to get information directly from the anti-Castro uh, refugees. We came to their headquarters, introduced ourselves. Uh, I said I was from Norway, my friend said he was from Turkey, and we asked them why they don't do anything to overthrow Castro. And the guys were very unhappy and said, we do our best, but the guys up there in the White House in Washington, they, they would not let us do it. That's the problem. Well, no one checked our identities at that time. We talked briefly uh, about, about a little more, and then we said goodbye and started walking down the stairs. And all of a sudden, one of the guys said, listen, why don't you show us your ID cards? Well, at that moment, we accelerated our down, <laughs> sort of trot, and jumped out of the uh, Cuban headquarters uh, into the car, rented car, and sped away. Had we been caught, we would have been, well, beaten at least. Uh, and as a minimum, uh, the uh, U.S. authorities would learn about uh, that um, adventure of ours, and we would be kicked out from the country.